three, two, one, let's go. That was very cringe, I'm sorry. <laughs> Interior design is more than just karate chopping a pillow. It's more than getting discounts on furniture just because you're an interior designer. It's more than doing it for yourself. <laughs> my cat made me lose my concentration. Ah, oh, these precious moments of being a cat mother. Hi everyone and welcome to my new video. First off, before I get into anything else, I just wanted to say a huge thank you to all of you who have already followed me and have been watching my videos on YouTube and have checked out my Instagram and my Facebook. Remembering that I'm still really new to all of this. Um, <laughs> I am definitely going to be making mistakes. I am not perfect by any means. This is all something brand new, but that's the best part. One day I'm going to look back on these times and think, oh, how precious and silly <laughs> I was, but it's all part of the process and learning. So seriously, thank all of you who are here and who appreciate my videos. I truly appreciate every single one of you who are here, even though the number is very few at the moment. <laughs> I still really, truly appreciate every subscriber, every like, every share, every comment. I really want to engage with you guys because I want to make sure that I'm creating content that you guys want and are looking for. So let me get into the topic of today's video. So if you guys are wondering what's next and what is coming up, let's have a quick chat about it. The next few things on the horizon that I think is really interesting is going into even more detail about what I do. I found this part of my life very interesting. It's not only my most interesting time, but it also gives me free reign on my creativity, which is why I want to show you guys all of the software that I've been using to showcase all of my work such as Kuham for my floor plans. I will also go through Floor Planner as well to show you guys a comparison. And I'll touch on SketchUp just because you guys might be interested in my opinion about how I find that software, but that is not all. There are some very underrated softwares that I think need to be spoken about. <laughs> need to be acknowledged because they are amazing. It is absolutely fascinating. And I think they are underrated just because they seem so technical. Maybe people find it intimidating, but I want to go into a lot more detail and like mini series about me working within those specific softwares for my own enjoyment, as well as connecting with you guys. And we can even get into discussions about what you would want me to create within the bounds of interior design, whether it's restaurants or bedrooms or homes. And as we go through all of these processes and mini projects together, it'll definitely build up my confidence. And I really hope that it also builds up your confidence because I was also in the exact same position where I felt like, where the heck do I start? How do I even know what to do? To clear that up, I just mean that there wasn't any specific clear guidance of do this first. It was mostly about finding the software that is most convenient for you, that is most cost effective, that is the easiest way for you to learn. And a lot of people then, I, th I think, personally, 
<laughs> that that is where a lot of people defaulted to just drawing floor plans by hand. I do feel that that is a necessary skill if you are ever put on the spot and you're sitting with a client and you have to draw up something to drum up inspiration or to show them a quick idea that you want to communicate if you don't have your computer or your iPad or the software on you to to draw on there it is definitely a vital skill to be able to hand draw things which is why <laughs> which is why I'm going through all the efforts of doing my architectural drawings which you guys can find on my Instagram which I post on frequently speaking of which what do you guys want to see me draw next I would be very curious to know what you guys want to see so the moment you've been waiting for the underrated software that I feel that needs to be acknowledged and put in the spotlight for a bit is Blender and Unreal. These two softwares don't have to be so scary. They don't have to be intimidating and that is where I want to set up a base camp of mini tutorials and mini projects that we can work on together or just out of your interest sake of watching me doing weird stuff <laughs> and learning new things. I want to create mini projects about how to build houses, lay out the right floor plan and what different softwares you can use together in creating a cohesive look that you want that will definitely up the level of presentation of your design process to clients. I am so excited about this, honestly. I can tell you guys how exhausting it is to go into YouTube and you type in something that you want to see done in Blender or in Unreal that relates back to interior design in general even, and it is very minimal. It's not seen often and I think it's because of how intimidating the software looks and thinking that it's just way too complicated and you must just rather stick to the easy peasy stuff, which is fine. It's A-OK -okay of whatever method you choose to do. I just want to show you guys all of the options and to give my opinion because I believe that Blender and Unreal and VR are very up and coming at the moment and I want to get on the wave now so that when it becomes a 10 foot wave I am surfing that with no regrets because we will be in those exciting times already and we'll be honing all of this exciting knowledge that we can use to up our game and who doesn't want that and in other news I also really want to start a blog where you guys can also come and we can have little chit chats about the latest design trends and decoration pieces and articles that have been written and we can talk back and forth about the subjects and a safe place of learning and questions and that is why on my Instagram in my bio I have the writing about getting your freebie and that was supposed to be found on my blog which I haven't started yet so I'm really sorry if you guys have been like where's my freebie because it was promised to me and I want it now I understand I have it it's it's there I just need to take everything one step at a time and build up the blog and then it will be out there for you guys to get so I'm just putting it there I guess in anticipation and excitement that it is coming soon I promise guys it's gonna come eventually and if you guys are watching this in the future and it already exists whoa. then what are you waiting for go get that freebie but right now in the present I'm sorry it is not available but I will let you guys know as soon as possible of when it will be available to download and if you guys are new to my channel hi welcome <laughs> it's so good to have you and if you're watching me for the first time I have a whole mini room makeover series which you guys can go check out on my Instagram and coming soon to my YouTube shorts as well. And once again, if you're watching in the future, good for you, go check them out right now. It's okay, go. I'll wait.
Okay, so <laughs> back to what I was saying. In my room makeover series, I go through the whole process, minus an accident of losing a little bit of footage, but mostly the process of transforming this space into my new bedroom, which also includes me hanging up the Star Wars bad boy behind me. Anyone else <laughs> Star Wars fans? So all of my Star Wars fans, you guys are gonna love this. So I encourage you guys to go check out my wall hanging slash Star Wars wall hanging video. <laughs> If you guys have any requests of what you want to see next, either in the softwares that I mentioned, or if you have any questions about those, please let me know or DM me at Heart Everlasting Designs on Instagram. All right, that's enough for this video today. I've taken up enough of your precious time. Thanks for watching. Bye.